With Photo Blend, you can create some interesting, useful, and fun effects in PaintShop Photo. For instance, to get a good, clean family shot, I've taken several exposures and selected just the best poses from each one and combined them into one photo. Or, if you want to take a photo of an object where there's things moving in front of it all the time, you can take several exposures and then remove those objects that were moving for one clean shot. Or you can have some fun by adding several exposures of one person into one shot, uh, making it seem as if that person appears multiple times. The way to do it is very simple. You set up your camera on a tripod preferably with no movement, no change in exposure, and you take several shots of the same subject but in different poses. And then in Photo Merge, you can combine them together into a photo like this. So let's see how to do that. First we go to File, Photo Blend. Here we have some instructions on how to do this. And let's select our photo. So we choose one of that pose, one of that pose, and one of that pose. Three photos is fine for what we want to do here. Okay, so we look at our three photos and we see the changes are obviously in his position and then also taking a look at the bride, we can see that she changes her head position a little bit. So now we simply brush in the part of the image that we want to keep. We can adjust the brush size here and just roughly brush it in. I'm going to speed up the process a little bit here so that you don't have to sit and wait for my every brush stroke. Now note that there's a brush out area where we've brushed in the previous one. This is just to keep that area clear. Okay, now we've brushed in all our grooms. Now we need to decide which pose of the bride we want to keep. So head up and further up. I think this one where she looks very stern and serious is funny. So again, we take the brush a little bigger and here we go. Now we need to see if there's anywhere where the bride is outside of the brushed in area. So here is a movement of her or train. There's one too. And here we go. So now we have one guy, two spaces there and there. Great. So let's say process. Okay. Now there we have a pretty clean result. And remember that we have some more tools here. So we can fine tune, we can crop this image, we can straighten it, and then we also have our brightness and saturation tools. And here we can go and take a look at clarity, for instance. The clarity tool I find very useful. Okay, that makes it look a lot sharper. And then we can also do a little bit of noise reduction. Let's just make a value of 5. Okay, and that's our image. We're satisfied with that. It looks pretty cool and funny. And now we just save it. And remember, when you save an image, uh, PaintShop Pro will auto-preserve the original for you so that you don't lose your originals.